streets gonna always be fucked. Yeah. 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 Let's go out the Holly yeah. Grove. Okay. Now put the mic on the map if you won't get on. Now put the spitter on the map if you won't get on. Now put the pole on the map if you won't get on. Say put the feet on the map if you won't get on. Say put E I on the map if you won't get on. K put the Drew on the map if you won't get on. Say put the Mark on the map if you won't get on. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a good looking rapper. I ain't trying to stunt. What up, though? What's cracking with all of my beautiful and my handsome BFFs out there, okay? That's all the members of the Blue Flame family. I hope all of my Scorpio collective is doing well. So we're about to get into this reading, you guys, and see what it is that you need to know. If something happened to resonate, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Let your girl Blue Flame know what's going on. If you are interested in a personal, I am running a special on my readings right now. Love readings 25, career, money, and finance 30, twin flame 35. If you got a question for your girl, we got one question for 15, two for 25, and three for 35, okay? All the information I just shared with you along with my email address and the prices will be in the description box below. So let's get into it, y'all. Let's see what it is that you need to know. All right, so let's get into this spread, okay? So y'all bear with me. This is a new deck that I got, and I had to literally go through and, you know, do like I did in my other decks and write it word for word, okay? So... We got the Knight of Coins. I'm going to show you this card upright, okay? But this card came out in reverse, okay? So this has to do with someone who was very lazy, okay? They have a lack of interest in something or someone. They bored, they're tired, okay? Some of you guys, you can be bored, tired of your job, you know what I'm saying? Or the money that you're making. This could be also someone that's very stubborn as well, okay? So this could be someone that's unhappy, with some things in their life, but they're refusing to make the necessary changes, okay? We also have the death card. Now, with this green, this gives me the energy of love. Like, there can be some type of unexpected changes, okay? Or some type of quick changes when it comes to life relationships. This could be death of an ego. Someone here could be finally showing some type of initiation, okay? This is also an ending, this is some type of ending that's taking place, okay? And this is a total and complete ending. So when it's in, it happened, baby. There ain't no second chances. There ain't no coming back from this situation, okay? So this is a total and complete ending because remember, someone here is not happy. They're bored in a situation or dealing with someone. Like I said, this could be work. Some of you, this could be a relationship here. Now we got the Six of Cups in reverse as well, okay? Some of you could be dealing, we got heavy Scorpio energy. And we also got the Knight of Coins. It's the Knight of Pentacles here, okay? So it's Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. So with this Six of Cups in reverse, okay, this definitely talks about some type of relationship or a marriage is ending. Remember, with this death card, remember I said there's a total and complete change that's going on, okay? And when this ending happens, okay, there is no going back. There's no second chances here. Now, someone could be thinking about their childhood. Maybe you, Scorpio, during this time, you could be reminiscing about the childhood, maybe the bad experiences that you had, okay? Maybe you guys are, are stuck in the past about a situation. It's like these bad memories from the past or a situation that you experienced. It's like, you just can't shake this shit. And it's like this, this retrograde, this eclipse season is really making something, you know, known. Or maybe Spirit is showing you, like, no, you ain't over this situation. All right? This could be someone that's refusing to look back. They moving forward, and they're like, uh-uh, I'm not looking back, Blue Flame. You're not wanting to reconnect with this person's situation or whatever this is from your past, okay? This also talks about faith, family members, friends, friendships ending, and relationships ending, okay? Why? Because, shit, people been keeping secrets, baby. Somebody here was keeping a secret or things have been hidden about the people, the circumstances, and the situations around you, okay? And that's why we got this Six of Cups. Some of you guys, you done had a lot of fake family members and friends around you, okay? And it's like it's, it's finally being revealed. Spirit is finally able to show you, especially with this full moon we had, okay? You guys know that's the time when things are, you know, revealed to you, okay? And you could have asked Spirit, like, show me, reveal to me who these people are because you've been having a feeling you got some fake people around you, but you ain't been able to quite put your feeling your finger on who it is, okay? This could be this moon also talks about some type of illusion. So someone here could have been trying to create an illusion because they didn't want something to end or because they were wanting something to end. This talks about betrayal, okay? This talks about someone that's difficult to reach 
or someone who overthinks, someone who spends a lot of time in their head here, okay? All right, so we got, I'm willing to put more time and effort in so that the love between us can grow, okay? So there is someone here that's willing to put in more time and effort into a relationship, into a connection, because they want to see it grow. And the only way that it's going to grow is if both people are putting in more time and there's reciprocity. So maybe you've been doing your part and someone here has realized, like, they got to meet you halfway. They got to put in the same amount of time and effort and energy into this relationship so that it can grow, okay? We got family and work responsibilities are weighing me down and I'm feeling overwhelmed. How can we make this work, okay? So this is giving me like two of pentacles, like someone here is doing a juggling act. You know, they have a lot of responsibilities that can be dealing with family, you know. <clears throat> There's a lot of things that's weighing someone down, that's making them overwhelmed, but it's like they're still trying to push forward. They're still trying to possibly make a relationship or make a marriage here work. You are very beautiful and you have no reason to be jealous of my past loves, okay? So someone here could be trying to prove to you, trying to show you like, you know, yeah, I might have had an elf of past, you know, but you ain't got to be jealous of nobody of my past, you know what I'm saying, or from my past. Nobody that I dealt with because I only want you, okay? Then we got, I want to feel the warmth of your body next to mine. Are you ready for a night of passion? Okay, so someone here wants to know, Scorpio, are you ready for a night of passion? Is you ready to get it in? Because when this person gets through with you, baby, the neighbors going to know their name, okay? So for some of you, you can have a divine masculine energy, energy okay? So you can be on a twin flame journey here. And there's the divine masculine that's going through these waves of emotions, okay? One second they good, the next second they ain't good. You know, one second they happy, then next second they mad or they sad. It's like this person don't know if they coming or if they're going, okay? But the one thing that they do know is they about to explode. And for some of you, the reason that they're about to explode is because you got some new love in your life, okay? And they don't like that shit. Scorpio, and for some of you, this person has been looking your person up. They're trying to figure out who the fuck is this new person, this new man, this new woman in Scorpio life, okay? I don't know nothing about them. I ain't seen them before, okay? <laughs> so let's get into this Jaded Love, you guys. Let's pull a couple of messages from my Jaded Love and see what else you need to know. Now, if you find that something resonates, Scorpio, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. If you are interested in a personal, the information I share with you, will be in the description box below okay i am running a read i mean a special on my readings and that information will be in the description box below okay all right so let's get into it holy spirit what else does my beautiful and my handsome scorpio what do they need to know about this situation messages for scorpio okay Ooh, look at this. Fade divine family. For some of you guys, that can be a fade divine film. Okay, this could be a third party that's looking you up online as well. Okay, because this card landed right here on searching. So for some of you, there's a third party that's looking you up online, okay, trying to get information, checking records, okay. This person doing like a whole deep background check on you, okay? Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more. Ooh, ooh, look at this. Sex only. For some of you, you could have felt like all oh, this person wanted was sex. So this could have been you, Scorpio. Maybe you wanted sex, you know. But there is the energy of someone who who you felt like wanted sex only. They always came at you in this sexual energy. You know, they ain't never call and check up on you and see how you was doing every time they hit you up. They was like, shit, what's up, Scorpio? What's up with me and you? You going to let me hit it or not, okay? I'm understanding that everything I truly want and desires lies within my twin flame, okay? So... Someone here could be understanding. This could be you, Scorpio. Maybe everything that you want, everything that you truly want and need, like the person that you're looking to give you this shit is your twin. Nobody else is going to be able to give you what you want. You know what I'm saying? But you could be feeling discouraged about this connection. Maybe there hasn't been a lot of movement going on. You know, for some of you, your person's still married. So you're like, how the hell? We're going to be together. He already or she already with somebody. Ooh, look at this. I want us to move in together. You guys, I did the horoscope today that talked about this as well. So if you haven't checked out that horoscope, check out that horoscope for March the 30th through the 31st. And it would kill me to have to watch you live your life with someone else. I can't make this up. For some of you, there's a third party and your divine masculine. Both of them are looking you up. Okay, for some of you, your divine masculine is looking you up and your new person up. And for some of you, there is a fake divine film that is looking you up online. So you got a third party and a masculine here, baby. 
that is looking you up online, all up in your life, trying to get background checks on your new person. Or for some of you, this fake divine film is trying to get a background check or do a background check on your ass, okay? Trying to get as much information or you dig up as much dirt on you as they can. And maybe they're just trying to look you up. They're just looking up information, just trying to see, like, who you are. You know, what's so special about you? Like, what you got going on here, okay? Ooh, so let's go to the who that, y'all. <laughs> let's see who this reading is about. Messages for my Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. And if anything resonated with you now, don't forget to like this video, okay? All right, who is this reading about? Messages for my Scorpios. Who is this about? Who is this reading about, Holy Spirit? All right, this could be about someone who has big feet. All right, we got a female who has nice legs. All right, somebody who work out, you know. All right, someone who wears their hair in a bob and has shoulder length hair. This could be about someone that's tall, over six feet. Let me get one more. Who, does, who is this reading about for Scorpio? All right, and we got light brown eyes, okay? So let's get the signs. Let's see who this is about. You can be dealing with Leo, Aries, Cancer, Pisces. We got Taurus, Cancer, Aries, Scorpio. We also got Heavy, Scorpio, Libra. Aries, we also have, what did I say earlier? Heavy Scorpio, Six of Cups, Scorpio Death, Moon Cancer, and Ruggle Taurus Capricorn. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.